So we are very excited. Ihar, thank you for joining us. Uh, sure, it's, it's a big pleasure. Yes, thank you. Um, so uh, in, I think it's evening for you. Uh, where are you hailing from again? Uh, I, right now I'm, I'm in Ukraine. I've, I've actually landed from, from the United States like around six hours ago. So on, on my way back from, from, from KipCon. So All right. So you're pretty challenging. Ukraine. I still cannot literally clearly get which time zone I'm in, but <laughs> my watch tells me that it's, it's 7 p.m. right now. Yes. Okay. So great. So hopefully you're enjoying some evening beats. So quick intro, Ihor Dovretsky, who probably you, many, many of you know, um, of course, the CNCF, which is the Cloud Native Computing Foundation. Ihor is a dev advocate there. And thank you for joining us to celebrate this major, major milestone for a CNCF project, which is Flux. So please take it away. Perfect. Uh, thank you, Tamao. Uh, yeah, it's it's a really big, big pleasure for me to be here. And as I mentioned before, I just made it from KubeCon, uh, like significantly big event that we had last last week in LA. Signif significantly big in terms of like the kind of like the pandemic times when we had like three three and a half thousand people on site and more than twenty thousand people online and. I believe that uh, there have been so many people who've been interested in GitOps and Flux projects specifically. And um, as you mentioned before, like there have been the Flux virtual and a physical booth there. And like, I haven't attended actually the virtual one because I've been on site, but I've noticed that been like all, all the time, there have been some folks who've been, uh, who've been showing up to the on-site booth, who've been chatting with the Flux maintainers. And this definitely recognizes the uh, kind of like the, the popularity of the project these days. Uh, I'm slideless today, no slides. Uh, just want to highlight about like how the Flux project is uh, is important for the uh, for the cloud native ecosystem and is, is and is notable. And it's worth mentioning that Flux is uh, is in in the incubation stage. So CNC, uh, CNCF has accepted Flux as a sandbox project a couple of years ago, back in 2019. It was like pretty young and emerging project. That was uh, kind of like the development, like the first development and the first enhancement of the GitHub of the GitHub's concept that was established a couple of years ago. Before that, so Git uh, so Flux is basically the Project that is the realization of the of the GitHub of the GitHub's concept, but a couple of years after that, uh, at the beginning of the of the current year of 2021, uh, CNCF has accepted that CNCF to see the technical oversight committee has accepted Flux into the incubation stage, which means that this project is no no longer recognized as something like brand new. Uh, nobody knows about it. Uh, the project that could have like kind of like the small user base and the code base and so on. So basically the accepting into incubation means that this project is well recognized by the end user community and it's well recognized by the developers community. And like, I'm, I'm honestly, I'm personally pretty excited about this. And probably this is the best time to shout out to, to all the Flux maintainers, um, including Daniel, Scott, uh, Stefan, Allison, and many, many others together with the community managers of this amazing project. So you are building this community together. And what is more important is that this project is not being built by the single company. It's not being developed by the single company. Obviously, this was, this was a project that has been born uh, and has been developed by uh, but we works primarily at some point of time. But today we have uh, a couple more vendors and a couple more uh, commercial companies that are building projects and are offering services on top of this project. And there are way more maintainers also from the different companies and, for, and independent maintainers who are making the contributor base of this project way more diverse and way more inclusive. And uh, this is definitely important for the open source project because you cannot, you cannot build a, the successful open source project, you cannot build a successful open source community by just building it inside, a, let's say, the single, single company. So this diverse community from the various maintainers from the different areas is definitely important. Uh, another uh, extremely important thing that I want to highlight about the Flux success and about the Flux, uh, Flux, Flux growth and Flux development is the, the number of the end users and uh, adoption by the end users. And 
as you know, the um, as most of you may know, the CNCF at CNCF we have the end user community, and uh, the end user community is um, on a kind of like the regular basis uh, uh, releasing the um, uh, the so called CNCF tech radar, where we're focusing on some specific era of the technologies, and the end users, the CNCF end users, are basically. Uh, defining and uh, letting us know about like which project they are using on a regular basis and like in which stage. So basically we can, they can mention that they're like just adopting and trying to use some, some of the GitOps projects or some of them are uh, like used, used uh, definitely intensively in the production environments. And when we released the uh, the uh, C CD, the CI CD, and the GitHub's uh, tech radar. It's worth mentioning that Flux was one of two projects, together with Helm, that have been recognized by the CNCF and users uh, at that uh, adoption stage that could be recognized as the, the most level of adoption. In other words, there is a big number of the CNCF end user member companies that are using this project in production. And from a personal standpoint, this is the great success. Another thing that I want, I want to mention is uh, like Flux is growing significantly these days. And uh, yes, Tamal mentioned uh, probably in some future we'll see We'll see Flux as being graduated. So at least with the current pace of development, with the current pace of growth of the community, and with the current pace of community involvement into the project, uh, we can definitely see this project in the list of the graduated project, which which can be recognized as the highest level of maturity, the highest level of the community adoption, and the highest level of the end user adoption. So uh, I hope that uh, all of you, we have more than 150 people here right here at this event. So I hope that all of you will enjoy this event. Uh, wishing my uh, best kudos to, to all the Flux maintainers and all the Flux contrib contributors and all people who are building this Flux ecosystem. So I hope you'll, you'll have the great event today.